Hey guys, my name is Rachel and today I'm going to explain the gross rent multiplier, which is something I easily confuse myself with the gross income multiplier, but I'll explain those similarities a little later in the video. So what is the gross rent multiplier? Why would people ask for the gross rent multiplier? When you have someone coming to buy a property and they ask about the gross rent multiplier, you will not be able to sell them on that property based on sentimental values. You're not going to be able to sell them on making memories in the backyard or anything like that because this buyer is wanting to turn around and rent this property or look at the income that they can make based off of this property. They want the numbers, they want the cold hard facts. So how do you get those numbers for them? When you're looking for the gross rent multiplier, you need two numbers, that's all, two numbers. You are going to need the selling price, not the asking price, not the listing price, the selling price, the price that this property is selling for the final price that's agreed upon selling price and then the second number that you will need is the gross annual rent. So annual means year long. It means the full year. Some people get tripped up there. They're given the monthly rent and they don't know what to do. But you guys know this. 12 months in a year if you need the gross annual rent and you're given the gross monthly rent or just a monthly rent number you're going to multiply that number by 12 and voila. You have your selling price and your gross annual rent. What do we do now? You're going to divide the selling price by the gross annual rent. So let's say that the selling price of a house is $120,000 and the gross annual rent is, is $12,000. Hmm? You're going to divide those by each other. So why is the gross rent multiplier easy to confuse with the gross income multiplier? Well, other than having very similar acronyms, the math looks similar to the untrained, it's not my money, I. The GIM, or gross income multiplier, is the selling price divided by the gross annual rent plus any other income that that property is bringing in. A few months ago, I went to the beach and I stayed at a property along with the rent that was being gathered from that property the owner was also selling their artwork and she could make additional income from that property based on selling her paintings. So this number, she would be looking for the GIM, her gross income multiplier. If you think you've got it, click the link below to try it out in the quiz format. For more real estate tips or examples, be sure to follow the channel. And if you have any questions, please comment below and I'll get back to you soon. Thanks guys.